Hello everyone, here is Karam. In this tutorial, we are gonna learn how to create a new preference file settings. From Autofluid 10, select the main toolbar Autofluid 10 and then click on Loading and Settings. On the left side, as you can see, this is the Autofluid 10 base preference setting. And on the right side, you can see the latest preference file I used. Click on this button, and then, as you can see, these are the details of the loaded preference file. Now, to create a new preference file, click on this button, and then select a name for this preference file. You can name it according to the name of your project, and then select Save. Now a dialog box appears and here the variables that you can change and control in your new preference file. First, select the architect drawings unit, millimeter, centimeter, meter. Then you can select the module which you want to change its parameters. Autofluid, auto gain, auto tube. It is easy to change a variable. For example, let us Click on calculations variables and then let us click on flow units. You can see here the air works air flow unit cubic meter per hour. You can change it. Here we have the hydraulic networks. You can change the water flow unit. And then we have the sanitary works. And also you can change the water flow unit. Also, you can specify the number of decimals. For example, here I can type 2 and then I click OK. Once your modifications are done, this new reference file becomes your new active one and you can work on it directly. Then I click close. As you can see here, the scale is 1 over 100. You can change the scale and then you can click a preview to see your reference file settings. Here we have the architect drawing meter, the scale 1 over 100. We have here the pressure drops unit pascal and the airflow cubic meter per hour, etc. And here you can see the directory where you save the preference file. You can change the directory and save it wherever you want. For example, the location of your uh, new project, etc. Then you click OK. If you want to change one of the variables, you can click on Modify. And then you are going back to the dialog box. And then you can select the variables that you want to change. And then you click Close. And then you click OK to activate the new preference file. And here you are all set. Now we have finished our tutorial. Thanks for watching. See you soon in another one. Goodbye.